working on the ear troll irrigation valve uh, the 2400 and how you figure that out is there's a sticky on the side of the valve that identifies it. The problem I'm having is my drip system which runs off of this valve wouldn't shut off so that in indicates a problem with the diaphragm. More than likely it's got a split in it. So basically you undo this collar on the top of the valve and take it off. There'll be a spring in here. And here's the diaphragm right here. We'll pull that dude out. It just slides on there. And we'll inspect it in place. Oh, oh I guess what we got? We got a split right there. That's why it's leaking. It won't shut off. So that's what we need to obtain a replacement for that and drop that in there and we should be good to go.